Hi everybody, welcome in. It's Laura from Tenacious Taurus, Twin Flame Tarot. And this is going to be a reading for my earth signs for the week ahead. So this is going to be for Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, any sun, moon, Venus, and rising placements. So we'll just kind of see what energies are going to be in and around my earth signs for the week ahead. I'm going to do things a little bit different um, than last time. We're going to get a couple oracle messages to start. And we'll see what messages and energies need to come through for my earth signs for July 11th through the 17th. See what energies are in and around earth signs, please. I do believe you are going through a major transition period. I feel you're definitely needing to kind of take back your personal power with the solar plexus. That is where we have our life force energy. So I do feel perhaps you are um, really dipping into what supports your sense of self this week. What is going to allow you to restore your sense of personal power. Perhaps you are really needing to find the willpower to choose a new direction. Um, but I do feel you're really um, connecting with your inner strength this week or signs. Definitely in the stage of a transition. Wow, we do have healing. So you're likely closing out a lot of karmic cycles. Perhaps you are really tapping into what is going to restore your overall health and wealth and wholeness. And I feel there's a lot of information coming forward about your path forward. There's a lot of harmonizing energy surrounding you this week, Earth Signs. And then we do have the passion. So I do believe you are restoring your passion for life again. I feel perhaps it's going to be a week of intense emotions to release any kind of hidden um, insight within any repressed emotions below the surface or sign. And I feel this is going to allow a sense of balance and calm to be restored in your life. And I do feel any intense changes during this transition period is allowing you to move from the chaos into the calm of your very core, of your very um, power center. And I do feel this is going to be lasting change. So that's really beautiful, Earth signs, allowance. So allow anything that is needing to leave your life to, to get out of its way, you know, allow things to leave, go forward without any judgment or opinions or any fear. And I feel the need for you to release any resistance to whatever change is happening this week or signs. Let's get a few more oracle messages and see what other energies and messages need to come through for my earth signs. Water your garden. So this is going to be a week filled with self-care. I think there's a need to kind of nurture yourself, to rest, to take a step back in order to get you back into the tenderness of um, self-care and loving yourself, earth signs. Definitely a need to um, nourish your body. We do have the cosmic heart. So I do believe this is linked to this healing energy. Perhaps you are going through a lot of heart chakra activations, higher heart activations, for you to really um, get devoted in your soul's purpose and what you came here to accomplish. And I do feel the energy really is encouraging you to get more present in the now moment so you can truly live your life like a moving prayer. One more message, please, for my earth signs. And we'll take the one that uh, flipped over earth signs. Trust in the timing, okay? Trust in the wave that you came in on. Um, time is never running out. But I do feel a lot of activations in regards to your purpose or what it is that you came here to kind of really accomplish. And beautiful energy, Taurus, the golden children. So I do believe... A deep level of inner child healing is going to be taking place this week. And there is a need for you to be very gentle with yourself. It's this energy of learning how to reparent yourself, I feel. To restore your sense of innocence um, on the journey once more. And I do believe um, perhaps you are tapping into a lot of rare um, soul gifts. Perhaps you are really stepping into your healing capabilities as well this week. All right, let's get a couple messages from the tarot 
I will get, you know, kind of like the current energy in and around you, um, messages from your higher self, near future energies, what might be hidden below the surface that you're needing to be aware of, and a potential overall outcome with these energies this week. So what is the current energy surrounding my earth signs? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Current energies. Oh, we almost had a huge pile come out there, Earth signs. We do have the Nine of Pentacles. So, this truly is a very independent energy. Perhaps this is a lesson in really gaining your own personal strength, your own independence in order to build um, relationships that are interdependent. Perhaps you have really been striving towards um, building a solid foundation for yourself, but I feel you're doing good, you're feeling good, it feels grounded and stable, and I do feel um, you're really stepping into your power earth signs. Messages from the earth signs higher self. Beautiful energy, earth signs. Um, we do have the queen of pentacles with the wheel of fortune. Um, and that's your energy, earth signs, the queen of pentacles. So pentacles are out here very, very strong. That also came out with the page of swords and the hanged man. So I feel this energy of you allowing the fates to, to push you forward. The Queen of Pentacles is holding a very abundant golden opportunity. And I feel you've worked really hard at building something, Earth Signs. And I feel the time is now. Um, with the wheel, this is positive movement forward. I feel you kind of have mastered a lot of life lessons. And perhaps there is a need to go deeper within your healing journey Taurus. I feel there is definitely a need for um, more knowledge to be had to perhaps do a little bit more digging in regards to your solid foundation of self. And with the hanged man, I do feel a new sense of enlightenment will be gained this week, like a deeper sense of self-awareness about where you are moving towards um, for the future. It's looking and feeling really, really good. Um, near future energies, we do have the Two of Cups. So this, to me, I feel like you're ready. I think you've done a lot of healing work already, Earth Signs, and I feel now that you're kind of really stable in who you truly are, perhaps this is bringing in a deep um, soulmate connection, um, something that is going to be very balanced somewhere or something where you will both see eye to eye, where you're both on the same energetic um, vibration, this, the same energetic level. Perhaps this person has also been watching you, waiting to come forward, um, wanting to send a message. So I do believe, uh, get prepared for a message um, that could potentially lead to a uh, a permanent soulmate connection, a deep loving connection here, Taurus. What is hidden below? Oh, I said Taurus. So um, that might be a message for my Tauruses out there. Earth signs. Um, and then we do have the high priest or the hierophant. So that is Taurus energy. So um, this very well could be a strong message for Taurus earth signs. But um, I do believe whatever is coming forward this week, earth signs, you, you really have watered your garden. You are encouraged to trust in divine timing at this time. Allow yourself to receive um, the energies coming forward. And I think you are just encouraged to stand still. Stand still and be open to receiving. Because I do believe a higher level of commitment is trying to come forward. And I do believe this is very much divinely orchestrated uh, with, with the wheel. Um... Okay, so I do believe, too, this is also you really stepping in to your healing calling, perhaps um, building a foundation with somebody else that you will be able to work with in harmony as well. I always think um, deep past life soulmate connection with that two of cups. And then we do have the ace of swords. So that is truth. I think a brand new truthful beginning. It feels like you really have conquered a lot of challenges are a sign, and it's time for you to kind of spread your wings and fly. I do feel this energy of um, fast forward movement. I think somebody is rushing in very passionately for you, Earth Signs, 
And this is going to be very balanced. So if you worked hard at healing any imbalances from past heartbreaks, from past relationships that were not reciprocal, I do believe um, this is going to be something very balanced that you're really going to um, be excited about. And we do have the justice. So um, definitely balanced energy. I feel a lot of communication. And I feel this is you really owning your own authority, which is in turn bringing in this very balanced energy. Top of the deck, we have the Queen of Swords or Signs. So I feel just pure authenticity um, with this energy this week. Perhaps you have really learned uh, some very valuable lessons in regards to boundaries and self-respect. Um, and I feel you're kind of in the energy of not allowing anyone or anything to stop you from living in your truth. It feels very, very good, Earth Signs. So let's get a couple more Oracle messages, and I will see what else needs to come through for my Earth Signs for the week ahead, please. This is the Archangel Metatron deck. So what message needs to come through from Archangel Metatron? You're definitely overcoming fear, taking back your power with conquering fear, and yellow, which is more solar plexus energy. I feel the need for you to release any fears about a new connection coming forward. And I do feel you are encouraged to kind of start today. I think this can blossom into a lot of joy and a lot of happiness. And I do believe clarity is coming. So if you have been in a little bit of a fog, unsure of the direction forward, I think a lot of clarity is coming and you are encouraged to do that self-care, that nourishment, to be able to go within, to, to gain that deeper insight, that deeper sense of awareness. So we will get one last message from my earth signs. A message, please, from Archangel Michael. You are guarded and protected earth signs. Um, thank Archangel Michael for protecting you and your loved ones. He is definitely ensuring that you are safe and that all your needs are going to be met. So you are encouraged to allow the acceptance of Archangel Michael's help gracefully and gratefully and know that everything that is right for you is coming forward and all you need to do is accept this gift. So that's what I have for my earth signs for the week ahead. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you haven't done that already. And feel free to check out the information box below. And there you can find my email contact if you would like to reach out to book a personal reading. I look forward to seeing you all next time. Thank you.